Okay, we're here with Steph Curry. Uh, just tell us a little bit about what you think about Jim. I know you've only spent a little while with him, but what do you see about his game that you like that translate well? What do you think you could work on just the five minutes that you said? And Jim, I think, you know, being able to shoot the ball is a lost start in the game of basketball, so... Um, you know, he showed me that already that he can, you know, spread the floor, knock down open jump shots. And as a point guard, um, he was definitely controlling the, you know, his team uh, out there on the floor yesterday uh, very well. They're running the play, he's getting the ball where it needed to go, pushing the ball in transition. Um, you know, for us shorter, smaller guards, I think um, being able to defend is something that, you know, people are kind of kind of uh, suspect on him, but I think with him, he, he definitely has the look that he can do it. Uh, definitely defend any guard that's out here playing. And, um, I think he definitely got the tool that takes to get to the next level. Cool. I look forward to watching him play this year. And you said, I mean, you were a two, a two kind of con- converted to one. Right. What would you kind of give him as, you know, kind of a some advice on making that transition where people said, oh, he's a two, he's a one, what is he? But now you are pretty much a one. Yeah, he, he's got to um, continue to study the game as a point guard, I think. As a shooting guard, you're kind of just freelancing around the court yeah, yeah. and everybody's looking for where you're coming off. But as a point guard, you got to know everybody else and what, yep. they're, what they're good at and, and where they want the ball. So it's a lot more responsibility. Uh, but you can't lose that, that shooting guard aspect of your game because it's definitely being versatile. It's cool. something that uh, gets you to the next level. Awesome. Damn, I appreciate that.